Good afternoon, and it really is an honor and a privilege to be here. Thank you. Though I'm Jewish, I stand here before you as the CEO of the Tannenbaum Center for Interreligious Understanding and not in my capacity as a Jewish woman. Tannenbaum is a secular, non-sectarian organization that tackles the power of religion in our society and our daily lives. So today, I hope to speak for the values we all share across our religious traditions and our secular beliefs. At Tannenbaum, our focus is on combating religious prejudice, and that really covers a spectrum of conduct. Something you can call the continuum of hate. Starts with ignorance and disinformation, and that leads to stereotyping, prejudice, discrimination. And then it keeps going to bullying and harassment and hate acts, hate crimes. And ultimately, if you keep going, to violence, extremism, and terrorism. The continuum of hate is a slippery slope. And that's really what we're seeing across America today, a speed race across that continuum. Daily, we're hearing name calling, stereotyping, and worse. It's frightening to hear our national leaders dehumanize others and each other, all for personal power and gain. They're leading us, but not on the path we should take. Their rhetoric is dangerous. And that's why at Tannenbaum, we provide easy to use resources for teachers and parents, community and religious leaders, so that we can conduct factual conversations to create a counter narrative that quashes the disinformation and the cruel stereotypes. And that's where religious leaders and really all of us have a responsibility. All of our traditions share values. All of our traditions call on us to live the golden rule. And if you think about it, that's really what America is all about anyway. We're about all men and women being created equal. We believe that all men and women are equally valuable and that all must be treated with respect and fundamental fairness because of our shared humanity. The golden rule and our nation's core principles really provide us with one, one vision, a vision that belongs to every faith and to each of us. That's why it's so important for our leaders to stop the hate mongering, the xenophobia, the sexism, and the venom. It's time to take back civility, and we can do it through faith, not fear by putting the golden rule into practice, by taking back our public discourse with our values and our votes. We can do it. And then imagine just how great our country could really be. Thank you. My name is Joyce Dubensky, and I approve this message. <laughs>